guys and welcome back again to my youtube channel it's your girl faith martins how have you guys been how have you been keeping safe in the wake of this coronavirus i am so aware that in so many countries there's been recordings of um, massive death i read the other day that the us might be recording 3,000 deaths daily from the month of june yes it is not funny everywhere in the world Thankfully, to an extent, Africa is containing the virus, although some countries in Africa has not started to, they don't have the capacity to do massive testing yet. But some other countries like Ghana, South Africa, Egypt, they are doing so much and we have very few cases that we're able to contain in Africa. I do hope everyone is keeping safe. I do hope this pandemic is over in, in a short time. Today we'll be talking about Chinese children learning African languages. If you've still not subscribed to this channel, please click, click the subscribe button, like and share this video. Guys, I stumbled on a video on the internet showing Chinese kids learning the indigenous language of the people of Nigeria from the southeastern part of Nigeria. Well, someone from the comment section where I saw that video says, nothing from the Chinese is to be trusted 100%. We do not know their plan. All right. Otu. Otu. Agwa. Agwa. Ato. Ato. Ano. He say, he say, he see, he see, asa, asa, he told you, he read. I am not against multilingual people. I am not against learning other languages. Kudos to every African that can speak Mandarin. I did even. I heard the other day that no, rather, I read the other day that. In South Africa, some schools take Mandarin as a compulsory second language to be taught in the schools. If you're from South Africa watching this, please confirm in the comment section below. Even someone commented the other day that they now teach Mandarin in Uganda. I do not know how true this is. I tried to confirm from people in Uganda. I've not gotten good feedback till date. Well, I am not against learning the Chinese language, but I'm somewhat against them like learning the Nigerian language. You, we all know that southeastern part of Nigeria is like the commercial base of the Igbo people in Nigeria. So, well, we do not know their plans yet. We just, we just hope and believe they are just trying to keep, teach their kids other languages well if you're able to learn other languages do not limit yourself to speaking swahili and english alone go further learn the mandarin learn every other language you can that is at your disposal you never know when it to be very useful so many youtubers that speak mandarin it's been useful to them in the wake of coronavirus because they're able to get more information even from the chinese language and perhaps when they come to nigeria you would not be cheated the way they speak amongst themselves well leave your so leave your comments and suggestions about chinese learning the african language do you support this is this a welcome development and also african countries that now adopt chinese language to be taught in schools i i read the one of south africa i've not con confirmed the one of uganda if you're from uganda watching it right now please leave a comment in the comment section confirming if they now teach mandarin in uganda schools guys if you've watched this video from the beginning till this stage i am so grateful please do not forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my youtube channel guys and share this video i'll see you guys in my next video bye